We're running! Hello and welcome to this week's edition of the latest in hobby robotics. My name is Fritz Lüneborg, I am sitting in my workshop in Denmark and on my left I have my friend Andrew from the States. Andrew and I, we're just talking about uh, why make a robot. Well, that's a big question because it's fun and uh, it's it's cool. You, you sit uh, with, with, with little things and pieces scattered all around the table and you put them together and all of a sudden it walks out to, uh, to the kitchen and you didn't plan for that. It's, it's a cool thing to build robots. But sometimes when you like peaked like okay I can build a robot now you figure what should I be building and then the challenges is a good thing there is a way uh, on let's robots.com where you can post challenges and there's a guy he uh, posted uh, a challenge which is the cross the gap challenge right right so uh, Winfield Robotics uh, posted a cross the gap challenge where you uh, you have two tables at the same height and 12 inches of space, open space in between them, and then you want to have a robot that will fit in a 12 inch by 12 inch box and be able to, so the size of the robot when it starts has to be 12 inches, within 12 inches by 12 inches, the same size as the gap, yet that robot has to be able to cross over that gap. And so uh, a bunch of people came up and rose to the challenge and tried to, uh, uh, tried to come up with different ways to do it. And uh, we had... Uh, Antonio came up with some pretty good. Actually, he, he entered multiple times. <laughs> he came up with a couple of different uh, tries at it. Uh, Kelpie Nick gave it a try. Uh, let's see. See out there, you guys, can you solve the challenge? We're challenging you. Till next week, my name is Fritz Lunabo. This is Andrew. Bye bye. See ya.